Shut the door. Hey, Sugar Ray, and every morning here at Actual Radio with me, Pete Chapman, for your Thursday morning. So, yesterday afternoon, I had a visit in the studio by the Blueprint Blues Brothers. Try saying that after a couple of pints. Uh, they're appearing in shows across Essex, then one here in Colchester as well. I started off by asking them how it all began. Basically, it started with me uh, when I was... Uh when I was 14, my dad actually got out the film, The Blues Brothers. I knew, knew nothing about it, and I was, we started watching it, and I remember just the ending was fantastic. Um, the concert and everything, I, I thought, well, this is my music, you know, this is what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. So um, I started to go to all the tribute shows and uh, just with my dad and enjoy them. And then uh, eventually in 2005, I bought the car, the uh, Dodge Monaco from the film uh, with the big speaker on top. So uh, is that your car? Is it, it? it is. Yeah. So you, that'll be there on the night. So is that the original car? Uh, it's not the original one from the film, but it's uh, the uh, same model and make as uh, the one from the film. It's the, very good. It's big. <laughs> it's, it's very big. It's very, yep. and I've just witnessed it outside. It's very loud. Uh, yes, that's right. That's <laughs> what uh, the, all all American cars of that age should sound like. So the show uh, has clearly taken a lot to put together, hasn't it? To recreate uh, something like this has taken a lot. Hasn't uh, it? Yeah, um, a lot of time, um, a lot of time finding players because uh, I only wanted the best players that I could get. Sure. Uh, on a budget. Yeah. Um, and uh, they are absolutely. Uh, I'm so happy with them because uh, mm -hmm. I only work with professionals and who are who can actually do the music ju justice. Really, uh, right. I've, I've had to kind of uh, you know make decisions that is kind of hard, but you know in the long run it's uh, it's healthy for the band. That's you know? showbiz, isn't it? It certainly making is. Making those decisions, you've that's gotta, showbiz. You, you have, yeah. You gotta you gotta be harsh. So what's uh, what appears in the show then? What's the show all about? Well, we've got a ten piece band, um, and uh, we're doing all the classics from the film uh, and the concert tours of the Blues Brothers did, and we're just going to make it a rip roaring rocking party. And uh, we want people to come down and dress up in fancy dress. Um, just really make it a part of the atmosphere because that's what it's all about. And of course, so, so where are the shows? Well, uh, there's one in the Whitton Public Hall, and when's uh, that? That's the fourth of May. Right. And then uh, then uh, we've got the twenty eighth of April uh, in uh, Mercy Centre in on the island of Mercy, and then we've got uh, the festivals coming up, uh, which is the fourteenth in North London, and the first of first uh, of July is um, where are we there? Oh, we were in uh, Leighton Buzzard. <laughs> well remembered those. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, and if, if people want to find out more about you or indeed buy tickets, how can they do that? Well, they can uh, go to the uh, Whitton Public Hall uh, website and uh, buy tickets there along with the Mercy Centre, do the same thing, or you can give them a call. Uh, or you can visit our Facebook webpage, um, which is up at the moment. We're currently working on a new webpage for our, uh, for our band and also the show, the duo show, because we do duos. Uh, as well as full bands, so we're we're, we're really a self-contained uh, uh, Blues Brothers uh, entertainment machine. Right. Okay. Uh, we can hire the car, you can hire the show, you could hire the duo or disco, whatever. So we've got full package there. Oh, okay. All sounds yeah. very good. Well, good luck with the show. Thank you kindly. Th thanks for coming in this morning, and uh, and Glenn, the Blues Brothers. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.